all right what's up y'all so we got another beat breakdown today and that is how i produced movie by ronald Sosa featuring central c and in my opinion one of central c's hardest verses ever made of course i'm no one got the party lit but explain what i've seen on the street got ptsd like an army vet i know how it feels to be broken rich ask me which one i prefer God. so i made this beat with my dog nko he's a producer from italy the part that i made is the sample so let's just jump into fl and i'll break down how i made the sample here's the sample right here you know we got like nine sounds all right so one thing i'm going to start doing from now on is anytime i break down a beat i'll show you guys the day that i made it yeah so it says right here i made this sample on september 28th of 2020 so yeah let's just get into the first sound right here which is some strings from omnisphere and i just played some chords with the top line here we go So all I did in terms of effects for this one is I just EQ'd some of the highs and lows out and I put some reverb on it. Oh yeah, and I widened the stereo a little bit. Next sound we got is these bells from Omnisphere and I think I put halftime on them. Yeah, so gross beat, halftime, and some EQ. Sounds like this. And if you notice, that's just playing the same pattern from the strings, just with a different sound. Next up, I went into this India bank from Contact, this right here, the India Spotlight Collection, and I grabbed a flute, and I just played the same note four times. And I have growth speed on it, I put half speed, half time. Next sound is the exact same pattern from the strings, except it's with the key sound from Omnisphere. With no effects on it. Right, for the fifth sound, we got a flute from Contact. This flute is from the Woodwind Solo Bank. Plays a very simple lead and no effects on it. Fifth sound, probably the weirdest sound in this whole melody. It's a guitar from the India Spotlight Collection and it just plays the same note eight times in a row like this. And all I did was I just put half time on it and that's the sound it's a weird sound but when you hear it in context with the whole melody you'll see why i did it it just adds a lot of texture all right next up we got another string sound from contact this time it's from the em emotive strings bank and that just plays a simple pattern like this and what I did was I put this flanger, flanger, flanger effect on gross beat and I just put it to halfway so it's not too strong. And I widen the stereo a bit. You'll notice in a lot of my uh, a lot of my mixer tracks, I just widen the stereo. So what that does if you don't know is it just gives it more atmosphere. So it just makes everything sound more spacious and spread out. Then we got my favorite part which is the vocal chop from Arcade. So yeah, on the vocals, I didn't put any effects on them, just left them raw. And yeah, to tie everything together, we got the sub bass from Omnisphere. It plays the same pattern as the strings that I showed you guys earlier. So like this. So here's all the sounds together right here. So 
So I don't know if you guys noticed this sound in, in there. But if you really pay attention, you can hear it. It just gives it some texture. But yeah guys, that's pretty much it for the sample. In terms of how the song came about, I already knew Rondo and NKO for over a year before the song was even made. And actually, the three of us already had a song that came out, which was Lubitin by Rondo, which is one of his biggest songs, actually. I think it's Platinum in Italy now. We already had a relationship built, and we were always working on music together, so the sample for Movie was just another sample that I sent to NKO, and it just happened to get used. I initially found out about the song when NKO had DM'd me like an audio message and it was a snippet of Rondo's part of the song. He was like, yo, they hopped on your melody. I'm gonna send you the project file so you can tweak some of the drum sounds and arrange the track the way you like and just do your thing on it. So I was like, okay, cool. So I got the project file, I just tweaked it, did some post-production and then I sent it back to them and they took it from there. So keep in mind, at that point, I just thought it was a Rondo song. I didn't know there was anyone on it, right? So a couple weeks later, I'm just scrolling through Instagram as usual, and then I see the cover art for movie, and it says Rondo featuring Central C, and I'm like, oh, damn, they got Central C on this. So now we got Italy, Canada, and England all on one track. You know, we got Rondo from Italy, Central C from England, and then me from Canada, Toronto. But yeah, crazy international collab, you know? Um, the music video turned out fire. I love this song. I hope you guys love it too. But yeah, that's how I produce Movie by Rondo De Sosa featuring Central C. So yeah, I'm gonna be dropping a big video like this pretty much every week. But in between that time, I'm gonna be releasing YouTube Shorts and TikToks. Go follow me on TikTok. The link is down there in the description. Make sure you guys tune into the short videos too. It's just gonna be quicker content and that's easier to digest than these videos. And there's gonna be a lot of creative fun stuff on there too. Let me know in the comments any type of videos you want to see, whether they're long videos like this or, or like shorter versions like for TikTok and, and YouTube shorts. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm just excited to keep going crazy. Um, new content coming soon. Thank you guys for watching. This was How I Produce Movie by Rondo De Sosa featuring Central C. Peace.